Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'll be showing you how to make stickers and a little make-do phone case I make using some of the sticker cutouts that I use so if you want to see how I do this then stick around and let's get to it. So the first things first is you want to just print out stickers so you can find a bunch on Pinterest if you just look it up and you want to size them to your liking and then just print them out. Once you print them out, then you want to cut them, and it's a long, tedious process to cut them. Trust me, it takes hours and hours, so especially if you have like a lot of stickers like me, I suggest that you just take a bunch of hours off and just listen to music and cut them out because it'll take a long time. But once you're done, it's worth it. It's all worth it, and you have it looking like this. Then what I want to do is to actually do the phone case first, so... I'll be taking a few stickers of my liking and I'll be tracing my phone case onto paper. Now what I should have done is traced it like this, instead I accidentally flipped it over and now the camera bump is on the wrong side, but that doesn't matter because I fix it later and it's just for planning out so I'm not actually going to stick these. So what I want to do is actually just stick or just put a bunch of these um, stickers on and layer them onto each other so it makes a nice design. Once I like the design, I just glue them on top of each other, so it's not actually sticking to the paper, they're sticking to themselves, which creates this one layer effect, so it becomes one piece of paper after you stick them to each other. And then you can just put them in your phone case, and there you go, that is it. It's removable, so it's not permanently stuck to your phone case, and you can make a bunch of these and switch them out. It's great, and I love it. Now onto the sticker part of the video, <laughs> um, you want to just put all your stickers aside, get your wax paper and lay it out, and some packaging tape. So, first you want to do is take your packaging tape and get a strip of tape out and just put it on the wax paper any way you want, face down, make sure it's stuck like this. And once it's stuck to the wax paper, then you want to get some of your stickers and just put them on top of the taped part, just lay them like that. Once they're laid down, you want to take another piece of packaging tape and just put it on top, just like that, and make sure it's smooth. And this creates the sticker effect, and now you want to just cut the sticker out. Now I recommend cutting a little bit away from the lines so that the sticker sticks good. So as you can see, I'm doing a border around that. And once you cut it out, your sticker is done. Now unfortunately for me, my wax paper didn't actually work, and I don't, I really don't know why this is the case, but for other people it does work. I guess my wax paper just doesn't work where I am right now. I really don't know why, but whenever I try to peel it off, it just sticks so much to the tape, and it sticks so much that the wax paper is actually ripping and refuses to leave the tape. So when I try to stick it on a surface, it just won't stick because the white part isn't sticky and it kind of ruins the whole sticker like that and it's really easy to peel off so that's unfortunate it should work for you but it just doesn't work for me not all wax paper does this because I've seen, I've seen like hundreds of videos and they all worked so I'm not sure why so what I'm doing is creating a, another way to do stickers if your wax paper doesn't work it's the same way, essentially, you want to take a strip of tape and place it the sticky side facing you. And once the sticky side is facing you, you're going to put your sticker on the sticky side. So I'm taking my Among Us character and I'm just going to be sticking that on the sticky side like this. And then you want to take another strip of tape and put, once again, the sticky side facing you and put it on the sticker. As you can see, the sticky side is facing me, and I'm just putting that right above the sticker. And that's it. The sticker is done, and all you have to do is cut out um, a border around the sticker. It will be a little bit hard because it is sticky, but it, is, it, it works. The only downside to this method is that you can't pre-make the stickers and store them. You have to use them as soon as you make them because there's no backing. 
So what I have is a little container in my closet and I just have all these pieces of paper in there. And whenever I want to make them to stickers, I'll use this method and then immediately stick it on something. And as you can see, it sticks really well and it works just like a sticker. It's completely fine. And I love these stickers so much. I hope you enjoy the video even though it's a bit messy. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, subscribe if you enjoyed, comment down below what you want to see next, and leave a like if you liked it. Bye!